Investigators say it all started on December 27th at a neighbor's house in the 1000 block of Thicket Lane. The couple's 12-year-old daughter showed up on the neighbor's doorstep with her hands zip-tied. That's where a resident of that house found the girl and called 911. I didn't want to let her in the house at all while I was home alone, and it wasn't until my grandparents came home. They came on vacation here and they left a couple days ago, but they showed up at the doorstep about three minutes after she showed up, which was kind of a, a deep breath for me because I was like, okay, then they can take her in the house while I go outside to talk on the phone with the police. 51-year-old Dr. Eugenio Arriaga and his wife had their first appearance in a Sarasota County courtroom Wednesday afternoon. Investigators say the child stated that her parents restrained her hands and feet with zip ties when she became angry. She also said they regularly kept her confined to a playhouse. When detectives went to the home, they found the playhouse served as the child's bedroom. Detectives found the door was barred shut with a piece of wood and the windows were screwed shut and the floor was discolored and reeked of urine. Detective Chad McDonald said the parents described themselves as being at wit's end with their child's behavior. I think in this case, we were fortunate enough, the timing was perfect, um, even to the point where my son, when he, right when they let her in, he walked out front and the father was driving by in his van asking if he had seen a, his daughter, and my son answered no. Detectives also say the couple defended their actions, citing the girl's behavioral issues. The couple has seven other children who told investigators the girl was often restrained with zip ties and kept in the playhouse. Florida Children and Family Services has taken the children from the home. Bond was set at $5,000. John Hill, SNN, Suncoast News Network.